Okay, here we go. How's it going, everybody? This is Dunkle Dylan here, aka Dylan. Yeah, my bad. Aka, you get the point. And today we are doing one shot of what if Naruto was the reincarnation of Rip of Fell Sands. So pretty much in this one, Naruto has not lived a good life, nor did he live any life at all. In fact, he was treated like shit over the past years. No one treats him fairly, and no one cares about if he lives or dies. So Izuku doesn't care about them either. But ever since that day, Izuku's actually been in, well, not himself lately. Everyone started to know that. In fact, the reason is because Naruto found out he is the reincarnation of a very powerful and very ancient um, person known as Sans. And he is from the Underfell Sans, mind you. And pretty much, Sans noticed how bad the humans treat him, so they pretty much he treats them treats him like a son, not like a monster. Even teaching Naruto some magic, and he learns pretty fast, actually. And pretty much, he starts walking away. So Izuku start. I mean, not Izuku, Naruto, yeah, Naruto. Naruto is now different. In fact, he is now more feared. In fact, so feared that no one goes near him, not without dying. Because Izuku has changed in a bad way. He Ever since Sans fell Sans trained him, he pretty much became more aggressive and more or feared and more hated among the people. He skips school, he pretty much doesn't care, and all he does is just stay at at the Uchiraku Ramen guy's place. Now, the Uchiraku Ramen guy doesn't care because, number one, he does somewhat care about Naruto, but not fully. Not to the point he'll adopt him, and but to the point where he'll actually take deal with his shit and him not paying his tap. Just maybe I say Grillby is the best way of saying it. it. So, yeah, that's all pretty much the best way of saying it. He's pretty much like, well, that. He acts like that. So Izuku, mind his own. So Izuku, now. I'll get some stuff. Well, not get some stuff. That's a, a weird way of saying it. Izuku pretty much just start. Arts walking toward. Towards the main locate. He starts walking to the ramen shop. Now, pretty much Ichiraku sees him and he's like, okay, here we go. Hello, Naruto. Hey, Grillby. Ow. Why do you call me Grillby? You grill me some food. Food. I would relish more, but I don't think you'll stomach it. Oh, God. Ah, the usual, Naruto? The usual. Oh, by the way, his parents do are alive, but they just don't care about him. So. Anyway, we actually get to Medreo, I think his name was. Let's shut. AKA Izuku's biological father. And this one he hears a knock. Come in. Um, Hokage. Yeah, what is it? It's, um, it's Naruto. What did that demon do now? Well, s s sir. Wait, he's stuttering. Is he afraid of Naruto? Actually, now I think about it, no one has the nerves to actually attack Naruto for a while. What happened? You see, sir, he's changed. What do you mean? He's a m m more a c c c c c c a c a slow down and breathe. He's more different. He's aggressive. He cares little. He's just 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 stop going to sc school. He's very. He he became. Something worse than we feared. We, we, we were hoping that you could t t t talk t t to him. The guy is so horrified of Naruto that he can barely talk. Look, I can talk with the demon and see what happened, okay? Will that do? Y yes, sir. Th 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 thank you, sir. Thank you very much. Th 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 thank you. Damn, he's completely horrified of Naruto. I wonder why. And pretty much we get back to pretty much Naruto. 
who's drinking mustard in front of Michirakurama, who gives him a look. What? I'm still trying to wrap my mind around on how the fuck mustard can get you drunk. Punk. I don't know. Well, I guess it's in my genes of me being a monster. Naruto the mon- the human killer. Suits you somewhat. Is that a compliment, Grillmy? Toby? Yes, it's a compliment. Shocking, I know. Even I doubted myself I would do the impossible. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, can I have more ramen? That's your tenth bowl! Oh, your point is? I'm paying you. Uh, actually, bullshit. When are you actually going to pay your tab? Man, as soon as anyone tries... As soon as anyone pays me? Okay, fair point. I might as well just give you food on the table, saying... Leaving you a note, I'd say, here's your ramen. But no, a be gone, sort. Yeah, yeah, you should. But then, how would you enjoy my glorious puns? Ugh. You not telling a pun at least for one day would be, be the most cherished thing I would ever pay. How about this? The more ramen you give me, the less puns I do. Deal. You strike a bargain. And bigger than the gods. So evil. Oh, come on. You wouldn't feather the, to it. it uh, fine. Just stop telling me puns. That's sure thing. Hey, give him the boot. Oh. Hello? Oh, demon. What do you want, pussy kage? Wait, not dad? Uh, Naruto. Sans. What? It's signs, you stupid bitch. I can't... I can care little what you say. I already know. Oh, about... Well... A mouse that talked. He looks at this person who is now shaking like a fucking leaf. I thought I told you if you snitch, you die. Apparently, I need to make that, that reality. He snaps his finger... And the guy, I just hear his bones snap, and pretty much hears an impalement. He turns around and realizes that Naruto killed his wife and his infant child. Now, the Kage is completely shocked that he did this. Mind you, this is Naruto's biological father. Naruto Sans, for crying out loud. Now get that in your head. It's Sans, not Naruto. Get that through your skull, or I'm gonna bash your skull in to get some in some air, so you can remember that fucking name, you dimwit. Naruto, oh, immediately, he doesn't care. Here. The Minero, whatever his fucking name is, Naruto's father, or ex-father, I guess you could say, is pretty much just surprised that he did that and doesn't even know what to say. Because he was expecting his son to be his old self, his caring, loving, and all that. He expected someone to make to make up a lie. For once, he wishes it was the truth. For once, he wishes that Naruto wasn't like this. What happened to you? What happened to me? When did you give a shit what I thought? I'm your father. Name one time you were a father figure to me. One time. Well, I'm waiting. I... Exactly, so fuck off. Oh, you're giving me a headache. And I do not wish to see your fugly face. Hell, it's not even ugly enough to fuck. No wonder your wife cheats on you with a fucking dildo. Oh. What happened to you? The village treating me like shit, so I decided to treat them like shit. By killing their children, and raping their wives, and sometimes their husbands. That isn't the way, Naruto. I thought you wanted to be Hokage. <laughs> Hokage? What makes you... What dumbass idea you thought that was gonna work? Man, you are the dumbest Kage I ever met. It's, it's disgraceful, Lily. 
Why don't you do me a favor and just jump off a roof along with your, your fat ass wife? If you call that fat ass a wife. <laughs> This is when the Hokage just walks away. Ugh. Finally. Ichiraku's not even reacting. In fact, he's just trying his best not to laugh. Is that a chuckle? No. Oh. You're trying your, not, your best not to laugh. You could say it was rip. It was bashful for me to do it. <laughs> I got you to laugh, Grilby. Damn you! Why, God, what did I do to you? Who curse you and your evil bun sons? <laughs> uh, I treasure this day. Hey, I wish it would not. I am going to remember that, though. Oh. I hate you. I hate you. You are a horrible, horrible person. Of course I am. I am the demon of the mist. Yes, the abomination to women. The killer of children. And the raper of man. And Errol, you take pride in raping men, don't you? Eh, they're easy to seduce. Don't give me that look. I'm not going to fuck you if that's what you're worried about. Sheesh. I'm not that low. You're low enough to kill children, and yet you're not low enough to, to fuck an elder? Er, hey, at least I don't rape them. Eh. Huh? See, even I have standards. Uh-huh. Hard to believe due to what just happened. Naruto, though you really lost, it, literally you have balls bigger than the Nine Tails Jin Jeriki. Oh, that reminds me, Naruto does not have the Jin Nine Tails Jin Jeriki, not not one bit. By the way, speaking of Jin Jeriki, who the fuck has that thing anyway? No one knows actually. Some say he never died; he just faked his death so he could live on for a while. Yeah, I would have done the same thing if I was that fox. Not surprising that you would say that, Naruto. You know I'm right. Well, yeah, but still. Anyway, I need to te I need to kill some people again. You just killed people last time. True, but it calms my nerves. Uh huh. Huh? Is it because you're it because you want to? Yeah, it's because I want to. You can say I'd like to give them the boot. Ugh, please, no puns. Yes, puns. You are a cruel and sadistic man. Of course I am. Actually, why don't you just go back to class? Man, fuck school. They only teach me is chakra control. And obviously you can tell I can't do hand side, so obviously the powers I use is not chakra. Yeah, what is that anyway? Would you believe me? Magic? He does the glistening hand thing. No, I would not believe it's magic. Of course you wouldn't, because that's the only thing chakra is the only thing that people can use. Well, okay, you got me there. It is the only thing I think humans can only use. Told you. Oh. <sighs> Just eat your ramen before it gets cold. Huh, thanks for the save. Eve, don't thank me. I'm only telling you this because well, then you'd be complaining. Dang it, I had to warm it up. True. And this one, he just starts eating ramen. By the way, Naruto has siblings, but he doesn't care about them. Until he hears. Hey, hey, uh, Ichiraku. Ramen, please. Sure. There goes my appetite. Wait. Naru, finish that sentence, and I'll fucking rip your heart out. Okay, what do I call you then? Mm -hmm. uh, smart kid. Sans. Okay then, Sansi. And this is when he get 
as it scraped from his leg. Ake, realizing it was a bone. Call me that again, and I won't miss your head. Got it? Nasumi? Y y yes. Good, you're catching up. You should learn your place. Uh, I, I, I understand. Good. Now, fuck off. Y y yes, s s sir. Good. Now, this is when he's Naruto uh, just looks at him. But you couldn't have done that more brutally? What are you talking about? You know, friending him a little more? Who are you and what are you doing with the old man? <laughs> Fair point, but I am him. All right. Hey. Bye. <sighs> I guess I'll be able to do anything. Yeah. And that's when Naruto just starts going in. Now, is that all? Yeah, that's all. Is that all? Or are you just happy to see me? Is that all? Yeah. No, I think, but I haven't seen that fat whore of sister of mine. Don't? Don't you only have one sister, though? No, I have two. Oh, my father there was stupid enough to marry an Uchiha. I don't remember her name. Miru? fucking care. Great. Oh, okay. Well, I tried. Now, anyway, Naruto's pretty much now just sat down and mind his own concern. Oh, and started pretty much looking around. <laughs> so, what now? I don't fucking Maybe I should just, maybe you should just crack up. But now it's not the time. I'm going to finish my ramen. I can tell. Oh. And this one I just start, this one Naruto just starts eating again. Mmm, tasty. <laughs> you enjoy eating the ramen. Yeah, I do. And pretty much this is when he hears, um, What? The, the, the Hokage is ask, telling you that you'll be go, go, going back to... And that's when he just grabs him by the throat. Spit it out already! The Hokage told you you're going back to school! It's not his place to tell me. I hate to say it, Naruto, but you should go back to school. Why the fuck should I? Well, number one, Naruto. Oh, you want to spread fear? You gotta do it in a brutal way. Killing... I think some of the most powerful children will be a great success. Uh, I suppose you're right. Tell the Hokage this. If he wastes your time again, go suck a dick. Uh, I, I, well, 
Yes, sir. Good. Now, get out of my sight. Y yes, no, S -s sons. Of course, sons. Good. And that's when Naruto just starts walking off. You want anything? What do you mean? I mean, do you want anything? Meaning, uh, you want me to kill someone and get you something, or, nah, I'm good. <laughs> Hold up! Y y yes, sons? What time do you say I'll be going back? Um, n now? Ugh, fuck it. <laughs> And that's when he just pretty much starts walking. <sighs> and pretty much Naruto, he realized he just got he just got to the school, and pretty much he just got, and he just sees the entire peep. He sees the school. Oh. Now he is just looking at it in disgust, in hatred, in in nastiness. He just gives it a look like, what an ugly ass school. How fucking ugly does this school have to be to be that fugly? Shit. I should have stayed at the Ichi Rock and Blowing place and ate some ramen. Man, and it's pork chop day. And fuck with Ichi Rock Ramen, he's like, do 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 Naruto is back at school, and I am free from his puns. Huh? And he sees a note. Have a good odd smell? <laughs> no! Even in Naruto left, his puns forever torment me in hell. Have I finally passed away and find out I'm in hell? Show yourself, the show yourself, devil! I'm ready. Um, Mr. Ichiraku. What? Can I order some ramen? Oh, sure. Or sorry about that. Had a little bit of a <laughs> had a little bit of a cuckoo day. I I I can see that. Is it true that no, no, that Sans went back to school? Yes, it is. And pretty much this is when Naruto goes in, and pretty much he just stays there. He doesn't even go in. Yeah. Naruto? It's Sans! You're my son, so I'm going to call you what I want to call you. And this is when a bone hits him in the shoulder, piercing the Hokage, and then it pulls back. You will call me Sans, or you die. Your choice. Fine, Sans. Good dog. Now, what do you want? I came to ask you why you're not in class. You told me I have to go to school. You didn't say anything about joining the class. So, fuck you. Go fuck your wife, who gives a shit about you. Well, anyway, Naruto, um, me and the wife are going to have a family dinner, and we want to know if you're going to come. I'll come when she sucks my dick. So, to your answer, hell no. Oh, I ain't going to your shitty ass, ass cooking club. Besides, her cooking tastes worse than fucking shit. And I know shit. I shit, I literally came it out of my ass last, last week. Her cooking's not that bad. It's nastier than fucking haggis. What's haggis? Something that you're too stupid to know. Now fuck off, I'm gonna take a nap. And pretty much is when Naruto just falls asleep.
But this is when he is woken up. What the fuck? Who has the balls to wake me up and who's gonna lose a finger? Or their children? This is when he looks at the, his teacher, Iruka Sensei. The fuck do you want? Why weren't you in class? None of your damn business. Now fuck off. I'm going back to Sleepy Town. So the rumors are true. He has changed. And not for the good. So he actually accepted the fact that he's a demon. But. I can't believe I'm saying this. But I want the old Naruto back. The old Naruto wasn't even this close to being bad. Was he? And he's back asleep. Why am I not even surprised? Maybe one of the class can convince him to come back. Though I doubt it. What do you want? Did you want something? Uh, n no. Until he hears, um, excuse me. Uh, uh, Mr. Sans? Mr. Sans? My, my, it was being so nice. What do you want? And this, when he just looks and sees, Neji? And Shikamaru. Well, who's you, hot stuff? Don't we have a sexy body? I... I... Well... Such a nice body. Why do you have one? Well... We were wondering... If... It sounds stupid. Aww. Why does it sound stupid? We wondering if you're single. What? What? Am I single? Is that what you're saying, little puppies? They blush, but they nod. Hmm. Yeah, I'm single. Why? You want a daddy bone? Yeah. I... Is that okay? Good. Then I guess we can do this the fun way. Okay. What the fuck? Now, pretty much is when Naruto. Oh? Just starts pretty much walking away, minding his own concern. Who the fuck is tasing me? Turn off the power. Anywho, you said something about the date. Are you okay with that? Well, I can't say no to two good looking people. But are you sure your family is gonna want me to be in their family? I mean, are they forcing you? No, this is actually our own free will. Then you wouldn't mind giving me a kiss on the cheek. They blush, but they do it. <laughs> That's just adorable. 
Okay. I don't see why not. I mean, I, I do get kind of bonely, if you could say it. <laughs> Ow. Holy shit, someone laughed at my jokes. That's actually kind of cute. Ow. Wait, did I just fall for an emo kid in and a very controlled freak? Then this when Naruto realized their voices are different. You two weren't male before, were you? Um, no. We were... We're... You can tell me. Tr trans. We're trans. Balls. Cute. You don't think us disgusting? Dude. I mean... Sir. It takes a lot of passion to be what you want to be. Just because you now have, you were a lady and now you have balls doesn't make you a monster. That's my job. Ah, uh, I'm the one who feeds the monster. It's kind of my reputation. But if you're worried about me abusing you, I don't abuse people. That gets my interest. Especially if they're good looking as you. Then you wouldn't mind coming to class? Hmm. As much as I hate it, I gotta make sure everyone knows that you belong to me. So, why not? Really? Really. Like I said, I gotta make sure that people know who my property is. Okay. See you tomorrow, then. See you tomorrow, cupcakes. They both blush. That's fucking adorable. Now, what was I doing again? Oh yeah, going back. And this is when Naruto goes back to Ichiraku Ramen. He just gives a look like, oh no. Oh yes, the pun master is back. You could say I was sending to miss you. <laughs> You unbelievable army of food puns! It wasn't a food pun, it was a sin pun. What's the difference? I guess you could say I'm hammed to meet you. Oh, <laughs> uh, You could say I'm catched up with more fantastic ideas. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Oh, cupcakes. Oh, Naruto. I mean, it's okay. You can call me Naruto. <sighs> Did you rock a ramen guy? Gets to look like Nani. <laughs> so, cupcakes, how are you two doing? We got hungry, so what do you like to eat? Well, mostly we just eat the vegetable ramen. Hmm. Eat your rock ramen guy. Yes, but that, but their meals on my tab. Ow. Huh? Are you being charitable? Well, they are my property. We're dating him. Ow. This one, no, this one, the Ichirakurama guy just starts banging his head and against the wall. I'm not dreaming. Naruto has a boy, has a girlfriend boys, actually, and I would prefer you call them he's. Why? They have a female... Well, Naruto gives the look. Oh! Okay, sirs, what would you like? Um... Vegetable ramen, please? Sure thing. I know what you're all thinking. You do males all the time. Well, technically, I have, but I said nothing about transgender. So, ha-ha! This is my first ever trans what-if anyway. Don't bitch. And besides, it's a tribute to all the transgenders. I mean, I do gays. I mean, why not transgenders? And no, and yes, I will do female trans. Just not yet. I'm rocking my boat on that one. What? A tribute to transgenders. This is what the what if is about. A tribute. And they're also to the fact that I'm not a good guy or a bad guy. I am a neutral. I am a god of chaos, but I know when to pick my battles and when to pick, pick the perfect lover. And besides, I never really did a Shikamaru and Naruto thing. 
Eh. So, yeah. Any who's and news and moves and booze and trip and strip and you get the point. Wait, let's get back. And pretty much they start eating their ramen. Oh, tasty. Anyway, I mean to ask, is the vegetable ramen any good? It is, actually. You never tried it? Eh, never could get the take. Never could get to it, you know? Oh, but what about you two? Is there anything I should know? Well, our parent Shikamaro's parents are okay with me, but my parents are very nobile. They prefer to have a son, but but they prefer to have a dog, two girls, but I understand. Say no more. Wait, aren't you Inata's best brother? We don't get along. Why is that? She thinks I'm a freak because now I have a dick. Oh. Then maybe I should pay her a visit. Please don't kill her. What about your parents? I don't have family. Well, you do now. You have me, Shikamaru, and Ichiwaka Ramen Guy as your father. Wait a minute! I didn't agree to this! I'll stop saying puns. Damn you! And besides, you know you care They're about us. Ow. Like fungus. Oh, don't be like that. And besides, you're alive, aren't you? And plus, you gave me free ramen. That's because you don't pay your ramen! And, 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 spill it, say it. <sighs> I care about you. Ha <laughs> ha, called it. It's, but that's only because... As you're the only one who keeps me company. Oh, I love you too, Dad. Don't you dare. Are we okay calling you that? Oh, I'm okay with you to call me that, Shikamaru and Neat, but and Edgy. But your boyfriend, no. Oh, does that mean I get to call you Grandpapa? No. Then let me call you Dad. At least I'm not calling you Daddy Son. <laughs> Father is fine. Don't call me dad. Don't call me dog. My dog. Don't call me grandpa. And definitely do not call me daddy son. It's just father. I'm fine with that. Wait a minute. Why do you want me to be your father? So I can make my shit piss of a dad jealous. This. Ah, revenge. Got it. <laughs> It's getting hot in here, and so take your clothes off. It burns! Sorry. Is that all? The money. Talking all that money. Anyway, yeah, that's pretty much it. But what about you? How do you do much? Uh, that's about it. Anyway, where are we? Oh, yeah. By the way, I've been meaning to ask you something. What? How come you don't... How come your sister, your daughter doesn't live with you? Oh, she moved out and pretty much married a, married a woman. I accepted it, so... You accept people too much. You literally are dating transgendered people. And you're gonna blow that out loud. Well, they're okay with it. And besides, they are my sons. Does that mean you approve of us getting married? Whoa, let's not ship that boat yet. Sheesh, you two are just dating. Anyway, you two, how's your ramen? Pretty good, thanks. It's fantastic. Wait, I have a question. Yeah? Do you two have somewhere to live? I still live with my dad, and I, I live with them too. Then I'm taking a guess that your father or your mothers are going to want to talk to me, correct? Um, yeah, probably my parents. I don't think Nenji's would. I'll pay them a visit tonight. Don't worry. I'll make sure they split up. <laughs> Can you make their death so painful? Anything for you, cupcakes. Aches my little lover birds. <laughs> Thanks. No problem. 
Anywho, is there anything else you would like? Well, that's actually about it. I can't think of anything else. Are you sure? Positive, babe. <laughs> he, Naruto blushes a little bit. Anyway, tell your parents that your boyfriend's going to visit in a minute, okay? I just gotta talk to your ex-parents is the best way of saying it. Okay. With Neji and Shikamaru, who goes to Shikamaru's family. Hey, uh, is it okay if our boyfriend comes over? Sure, why not? Ow, wait a minute. Boyfriend? Who are you two dating? Well, promise you won't scare him? I mean, you won't decline him? Who is he? Y you'll see. With Naruto, who just killed the who killed Neji's family. So you're Neji's dad, huh? Why have you attacked us? We're not- we didn't bother you! True, but you abused my boyfriend. You see, Neji is my property. And those who harm my property, I get angry. And since you harmed my property, and this is when he starts forming up some bones, I get ang I get very, very monstrous. What do you mean by that? Simple. I'm going to kill you the most brutal and the most sadistic way I can think of. You will be begging for the sweet release of death. You will be begging me to cut your dick off and then shove it in your throat. <laughs> You're a monster. I am known as the monster of the leaf village. <laughs> oh no! And pretty much this is when Naruto starts summoning bones after bones, impaling Neji's father's stomach to the point where his gut starts spilling out and pretty much his bone own starts splitting and and pretty much you can just hear the bones crackling and the stabbing. And pretty much now he looks like he's just been stabbed by a freaking you know, horde of spears. Here's, and finally, the finishing touch by be, by pouring a little bit of, of... Oh, what am I saying? He's taking a piss on his corpse and then he finally took a shit in, it, in the guy's mouth. Yeah. Eh. Well, that's better. But this is when he just wipes his ass with, uh... Well, with the Neji's father's cloak. There we go. And this one they just hear knock, knock, knock. Oh, that that must be him. Huh. Okay. Let's go see how your boyfriend is. And this one they open. Hello, you must be. Hi. So that's the sons. Oh, please call me Naruto. So you're my boyfriend's parents, right? Uh huh. Cool. Nice to meet you. This is when Shikamaru's dad just goes. Ugh. <coughs> <coughs> that actually went better than I expected. Truth be told, same. Aim here. <laughs> Anywho. Actually, what is that smell? That smells delicious. Oh, th that's my mom. That's our mom's cooking. Wow, it smells great. Hey. And this is when they just see here. Oh, hello, sons. Ah, S sons. I didn't know. Calm down. You can call me Naruto. Oh, you are my boyfriend's parents. Ba 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 ba. Sweeties, why didn't you tell tell me you were well? Well, we were worried that you would de not accept him. Oh my angels, I would. It's just that it's just surprising. That's all. I know, but he is a nice guy. We promise. I'm not disagreeing, but still. Well, <laughs> uh, sorry for not telling you. Yeah, it's fine, sweeties. Just don't scare me like that again. It's okay. Why? Oh, your father's on the floor. Eh, Naruto scared him by accident. It's, I'm not surprised. Anyway, nice to meet you. You already know who I am. Yep. 
But yep, you are, uh, Mrs. Shikamaru, right? Yeah, that's my name. Mrs. Shikamaru. No. And pretty much Shikamaru, whose father finally woke up, and he realized that Naruto's not a bad guy. Hey, he's just misled. So, what if they tried... I heard that you go back to school. Yeah, but only because Neji and my... Neji and he not ne Neji and Shikamaru asked politely. Lee? Lee. Lee. Huh. Ah. Anywho, did you need some? Anywho. Mind if I crash here for a little bit? Yeah, sure. And pretty much with the news of Maki's. I told you he's not coming. You're right. So. Oh, you too? Actually, I've been meaning to ask. Yeah? How much did my father suffer? Huh? The Hinata's father, I mean. Oh, let's just say she's gonna be traumatized. <laughs> she's gonna have a lot of the tuning up with her relationship. <laughs> I don't know if I should be concerned or grateful that I, that the guy is dead. Probably both. You could say it was hands down on my artificial work. <laughs> Ow, oh boy. Boy. So, Naruto, uh, you said you're going back to school? Yeah, probably back at, uh, what's his name? Okay. Though, I gotta ask, Cupcakes, why did you fall in love with me? Eh, uh, I think they got that from me. That's how I met your wife. I'm telling you, yes, she was the bad boy. <laughs> no, I was a... Actually, I was a priest. <laughs> what? Yeah, I was a priest. I worshipped the tailed beasts. I was a member of a cult. Your father was supposed to be a... Well, my husband was supposed to be a sacrifice, but I got attached and, well... Okie dokie. Eat now. Talk about a weird day. Okay, now I've heard everything. And talk about a day. Hey. hey. Well, anywho. Who? It's good to know that my love. Lovers are having a nice, have a nice, have a non-abusive family. Yeah. Yeah, we make sure of that. We don't want to end up like the Uzumakis. Oh, so you heard of what they did. Yes, you and I have to admit, I'm having a little bit hard time of believing it, but at the same time, I don't. I always knew they had a bad rap, but to the point of abusing and neglecting a child because of a false rumor? Oh, so you heard of that. Everyone heard about it, but no one wants to say no. They're the Hokage. Every, now everyone regrets even a butte for pretty much doing what they did to you. Now they think you're a monster, but really I had to see a broken child. Huh. <laughs> How cute. But thanks. <laughs> you're welcome. But what will you do after all this? What do you mean? I mean, when you... What is your dream? I, I, if you don't mind me asking. Uh, probably run my own ramen shop. Seriously? Seriously. But the only reason I'm becoming a ninja... Because... I was like I said, those who want to. Actually, we don't. Oh, but... We gotta keep the family line. Otherwise, we'd be kicked out of the village. Now, that's just stupid. And, but I get that... I bet that big message I gave to the war about me killing hey, what's-their-face is probably a good enough message to know not to mess with you two. You 
think it'll be enough? Oh, believe me, I know it'll be enough. I hope so. It is, I promise. Anywho, let's enjoy our food. Okay, and this one they can start enjoying their food. Thanks for the meal. No problem. Anyway, would you like to stay here for a little bit? I don't see why not. Huh? Do you two share a room? Yeah, why? Good. Because Daddy Bear is sleeping with you two. Okay. Hey. And pretty much they just walk upstairs. And pretty much now they just cuddle with Naruto. <laughs> you know, this is actually pretty comfy. And pretty much this is when they wake up. After hearing Neji's alarm clock. Ugh. Whack! He just smashes the alarm clock. Oops. <laughs> Sorry about that. It's fine. I was going to do that, actually. Morning. Ow. Morning. And, uh, nice ass, by the way. Neji blushes. <laughs> I'll look away so you can dress. And he just looks away. <laughs> Pervert. Oh, don't judge me. We're not, but still, please look away. It's... I know, I know. Oh, sorry. It's fine. I... It's just your nature. <laughs> yes, it is. And pretty much is when they finally get cloaked. Now, pretty much, this is when they just all start going to the class. And it's after eating breakfast. They finally get to the class, and they just see Naruto walking in with Neji and Shikamaru. Everyone is now in fear, realizing who's in this class. As, and they f actually get the point pretty quickly who, who Neji and Shikamaru are holding. <laughs> so, you know who they're dating. Then you know what will happen if you try to harm them. <coughs> You'll end up an orphan, just like little Hinata. <laughs> Killing your family was fun, Hinata. Try to get another one so I can kill them again. <laughs> ah, Hinata, all she could do was cry. Now, you must be our shitty teacher. Y yeah, I'm, uh, I know who you are. I just don't give a shit. Start doing your job or I'll kill your entire f class here and now. Y yes, sir. And pretty much this is when they're learning about everything, but Naruto doesn't pay attention because, number one, he thinks it's stupid. And plus, he uses magic. He doesn't need chakra. All they hear is just Naruto snoring. <laughs> anyway, uh, today, class, we're having a very honorable well, guest. And this one in the Hokage walks in. Uh, Hokage! Hey. Hello, everyone. And... Naru, and that's when he just shows his eye. I, I mean, S Sans. Good. Try saying that name again, I'll cut your balls off. And then I'll murder your wife and children. Don't think I don't know she's pregnant. Mm -hmm. <sighs> hey, Naruto. Mm -hmm. What is it, cupcakes? It's oh. What da- I didn't call you- try to call you Naruto. You threatened to cut my balls off and kill my chick- my great- your little- oh, chick- your sibling. But when they call you Naruto, it's okay. Hey. What is it? Well, we were wondering. What? Can you cook? Why? 
Well, you've been to eat your rocket ramen place for a while. We figured you do. I do, cupcakes. I do. They smile cutely. <laughs> would you like to take a nap? Nap with me? Sure. Uh, they need to... Did I stutter? N no, sir. Good. Now shut the fuck up before I kill you. Of course, uh, Mr. Sans. Sans. Great. I am scared of the one kid that treat I treated like shit. That I treated shit. Anyway, this is when they just go through everything. But pretty much Sans doesn't even try anything. Like, he just thinks it's stupid. Now I think about it. I wonder how bad the world is now. Oh well. Then pretty much is when Naruto just starts going back to a little sleepy town. And pretty much this is when Hokage starts teaching, but Naruto doesn't pay attention because he doesn't give a shit about the Hokage. Man, does the Hokage ever shut up? Seriously, that's actually getting annoying. <sighs> well, I guess that's it. Time to... Anyway, this is when class starts. Finally, it's over. Ugh. Finally. I was wondering how long it would take for them to shut up. <sighs> oh, well. And this is when Naruto pretty much just walked. This is when I all just start walking out of class until Naruto feels someone grabbing his arm. You have about five seconds to release me, otherwise it's gonna be a bad time. For you. But I will have a great time. And he knows it's not Neji and Shak Sakura. I mean, it's Neji and Shikamaru because they don't grab him by force. What happened to you, brother? What do you want, Sasuke? Hey, no, Uchiha. Just don't feel like I calling you by your real name. Why didn't you come to dinner last night? Uh, because you're not my parents, and plus we were never a family. Just because you're my blood doesn't mean I give a shit about you. You want a new sibling? And get pregnant. I don't care about you. Now, if you excuse me, I got two boyfriends to go to. Oh, and a warning if you dare grab me like that again. <laughs> and that's when Naruto just takes one of that takes the Uchiha's eyes. She screams in pain, and pretty much she starts hold he holds it. Let that be a reminder to you. <laughs> and he just puts it back in. And it's when he just put drops it on the ground and just stomps on it. You're probably wondering why he does that. Well, simple. He's a skeleton. Actually, no. Naruto actually he rips out his other eye, not the, the eye that doesn't glow, and puts it a Uchi eye in it. Thanks for the upgrade, brat. <laughs> and that's when Naruto just starts walking. And pretty much this is when I finally managed to get... Yeah, this is when they just get back to clap. We get back. But this is pretty much over a couple of days. Naruto actually managed to graduate, mostly because of his powerful ways of doing it. <laughs> now. How are you do? Anyway, where should we do now, cupcakes? Hmm, I don't know. What do you want to do? Hmm. Want to go to your parents' house? Sure. <coughs> when they get to their parents' house, 
This is when they see that the worst day of Naruto's life is here. The Hokage and his family in his house. Mr. Shikamaru, dare I even ask? They let themselves in. And hey there, son. Call me son and say bye bye to that fat bit itch of a baby you call. Oh, a child. She looks down. That's what I thought. Uh, are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Just annoying. Actually, like, anyway, you two, like I said before. <coughs> God damn. you said to me we were never a family kind of a dead giveaway what you said you really think I'm gonna forget that easily well well do you no I don't think so do you want to know why I'm not going to forgive you Because of what we did. I'm sorry, I didn't get that. Because of because of what we did. Exactly. Because of something you did. And what would that be exactly? Neglecting and abusing you. Correct. So, what made you think it was a good idea to come into this household? And try to talk to me. When you knew, I want you dead. Because, obviously I do. So, whatever got into your mind, thinking that visiting me was a brilliant idea, you obviously need to see a doctor, because... That had to be the most dumbest idea you ever made. Because I want nothing to do with you. Not one bit. And if I did, I wouldn't care. But since you're already here, and you already made a mess of our beautiful establishment... I might as well just deal with it. Wait, so that means... Don't get any stupid ideas. I don't forgive you. And I never will forgive you. Keep that in mind. The day I give a shit about you two is the day A, I'm drunk as hell. That's the only time I'm gonna forgive you. Now, if you excuse me, I actually have someone to give a shit about, and that's called my family. Too? Shit. Let's go. Wait. Uh, what now? 
here. The fuck is this? Your bed, your headband. You washed your hands, right? <laughs> yes, I washed my hands. You expect me to believe that? Would you like me to re-wash my hands? Um. Nah, it's already polluted. Okay, Kage. Besides you giving me this, <coughs> why else are you here? Well, I'll be telling you that your teammates will be at. I'm going to start you right there. I'm a solo type of guy. I don't work with whatever you call a team. I'm a solo. And I demand that you make allow Hina Shikamaru and Neji to beat running a ramen stand. And without losing their honor. I can't just... You can and you will. If you value your kid's life. Okay. Good dog. Now, what is this mission you wanted me to do? Who exactly? Well, you see, we've been getting a number of reports of missing ninjas over the past weeks. That my problem? Well, no, but still, it should be informed to you. Just in case. <sighs> Okay. Who went missing? Many of our students have gone missing. Names? Oh, um, mostly it would be, well, I don't got all day. Mostly, it would be my daughter. You want to send the one person who hates your sibling, I mean, who hates your daughter to the guts, to look for her. Yeah? Ugh. And what makes you think I will? Oh. And don't you dare pull that, it's your sister. It ain't gonna work on me. What's the real reason? Because you'll be paid. How much money are we talking? About five to seven hundred yen. Yen. As an actual yen. E yes. What do you two think? I say take it. I mean, we'd be able to get out, out of this place. Hey, uh, not in a bad way. I mean, you know. Yeah, we know. We know. I guess. 
guess that makes sense. Though, uh, say that I do help you. Will you go back on your word? No. I will keep my word and I will allow Neji and your boyfriends to... Oop, they're both boys. Neji and your boy... I mean, your boyfriends to... Be what they want to be. Good. Shouldn't be that hard to look for someone like your shitty ass daughter. Huh? Like it shouldn't be that hard because I can already sense her. And this one is she just teleports. And this is Naruto teleports. And this one he just comes across. Well, <sighs> someone. Ah, so you must be the Jin Cheer. You must be Naruto. Yeah. Are you came here to save your dog, your sister? She, one, she's not my daughter. I mean, one, she's not my sister. And two, fuck that. Er, wait, what? You hear me? Fuck that. I don't want to help her. Her? Her? If it was up to me, I would let you keep her. Keep her. Her with a passion and let you do God knows what to her body. I wouldn't even care if you make you fucking raped her. But I'm being paid to rescue her bony ass. Wait, wait, wait. So you don't care if she dies? Not really, no. Then why are you saving her? Because I'm getting paid to. Fair enough. But still. If you hate her so much, <coughs> much, yeah, yeah, why even bother? Like I said, she, eh, you know what, fuck it, just die. And this is when he just kills Orochimaru instantly. With a beam. Now you're probably thinking, Orochimaru will survive that. Getting incinerated, waving nothing, at all is kind of almost impossible to survive. So, no, he will not survive it. I don't want to hear it. And this is when he just takes Sock, his sister, and holds him there. Here you go. <coughs> <coughs> Now, keep your end of the bargain. Okay, okay. They can do what you want them to do. You hear that? You two get to become chefs. Nice. Now, let's see what we can do. Anyway, I'm going to do a time skip. Pretty much we get to the part of their wedding. The wedding goes perfectly. And pretty much Naruto and, and his lovers pretty much just live a happy life. It, they even adopted two kids. It's one named, named, named Papyrus. The other one named, named, named I'm going to say, Frisk. Because the other one was a girl. <clears throat> All right. Now that I got that underway. Eh, I might as well see what else I can. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Hey, uh, Dad? Yeah, son? Uh, I've been meaning to ask. Yeah? How did you and Dad's meet? Heh. <laughs> well, Snark, well, Papyrus, sit down on your father's lap. 
That's a story that is fantastic. Ow. Uh, and why? Hey, because I love making papa jokes. Indeed he does, and he loves to keep his husband's company. <laughs> and bleh, get a room, you two. Oh, one day you'll fall in love, son. And daughter. No, boys are icky. Hey, does that make us icky? Only when you kiss. <laughs> you can say it's puckering up. Oh. <laughs> Sons. Hans, babe. <laughs> uh, I did not need that image in my head. Ew. <laughs> uh, oh, I love being a jerkwad. But, well, there are other things you could do. Kids, it's pa it's now bedtime. Aw, oh, but mom, no buts. Now. I think we were about to do something. Me and Shikamaru want to reward you for being a good husband. Oh. And he just starts dragging him. Next thing you know, Neji takes off his shirt. <laughs> and I'm not even going to go there. I'm going to leave it off here. I know there's not that many mean violence, but come on. Doing Sansa's voice is not that easy. And before you ask, yes, I will think of doing another Undertale What If. I just don't know which one. And I heard a comment. Minecraft? I never even played it. it. So I may not do it. Like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. This has been Dunkle Dylan here, a.k.a. Dylan Breeden. Bye.